Yo. Welcome back. Mm, sorry, wait, let me do the voice. <clears throat> Welcome back, Guardians, to another Destiny 2 video. In today's video, we will be actually hopping on the game called Fortnite Battle Royale to take a look at the crossover event they just did recently. So, without further ado, let's get into it. Sorry, I, I had to do that voice at least once. <laughs> But yeah, they're finally in the game. It's so weird to see them here. Because I already went on the map, but I'll show you that in a second. This is like the first part of stream. We're going to look at the Fortnite stuff. And then we'll actually hop on Destiny and do all the Destiny stuff. It's just yesterday I was getting pissy because like I couldn't progress the quest. So, And plus, I was so tired yesterday, man. Holy shit, I was mad tired. Yes, I can't, I can't get over how weird it is. Like, we have these guys and these guys at the same place, like. Man, right. So, uh, j just in case people don't know, uh, yes, this, this is who I use in... I use Tilted in Tang. Because, like, I'm thinking, like, people who click on this will probably be here for the Destiny stuff, but, like, we'll see the Fortnite stuff first, but... Right, let's have a look at them in-game. Let's see what they're like. <laughs> So we got Legends of the Light and Dark Bundle, which actually that's pretty cool that they have all three of them in the one. And they even have like Ghost and the, the fucking fish. I can't believe I didn't like, bro, like Fortnite gets the fucking fish in game before we get the fish in game. That's kind of sad. I'm not going to lie, I realize I don't have tissues, so I might actually have to go soon and just get some. So yeah, let's just take a look at everything. Oh, I knew it. Yeah, so it's a back bling. That is the weirdest back bling, though. Is it like a pet? Like, can it turn around? So, Commander Zavala's ghost. Oh, just call it Sundance. That's what it is. It's called Sundance. I don't know. Oh, it does turn around. That's so cool. That is legit so cool to just see ghosts. Like, <laughs> that's basically the ghost in thing. Like, that's ripped straight from the game. You can't tell me otherwise. That looks so cool. That is weirding me out how well that is. And then let's take, take a look at the fish. Bruh, look at this thing. It's so weird that it's like... It's just there. Oh, and it's doing the thing in the trailer, I think, as well. It's like just swashing around. That is so weird. Like, uh, low-key, I'm actually kind of tempted to buy the pack. Oh my god, it's Savala smiling? Yo, wait, 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 Savala, you're not meant to be smiling, bro. That's weird. The price of six items is thing. Like, again, I'm so tempted to. I'm legit, just because of the ghost thing. Literally because of the ghosts. And I know I can't, like, get thing unless I get ghosts. Sorry, okay, sorry. Let me actually zoom out for a minute. There's Savala. Wait, why was he... Wait, he was smiling, wasn't he? Again, it's so weird to just see him in game. <laughs> Hello, Guardians. Today, we'll be cranking 90s on these bots. Look at Ikora. Just chilling. Man, if this was back, like, a few, like, years ago, they would be like, what? Ikora might actually become useful, but, like, in a different game? Madness. Honestly, I might just get, like, Ikora by herself. Ju just for- or maybe Zavala's. Like, I might get Zavala separately just for the ghost, honestly. Um, and here's Elsie. But then again, how could- how could you say no to Elsie? Let's be fair here. I was taking this right now, right? Because if you look at the news. Where'd it go? Oh, it, it's gone. Okay, I guess you don't get to see it. But in the news segment, they had... Um... Oh, there's oh, there's other stuff here as well. Okay, I need to check that out in a minute. But, um... Like, in the thing... Like, if you look at them, it's like... If only if Cade was still alive. Cade would be right here. And his ghost, rather than Elsie. Because I can't think of any other reason why Elsie is here, honestly. But then again, like, I think everybody wants to buy her now, just, just seeing her there. Now, the real question is, though, right, would I want to spend... That's 1,500, so I'd literally just need to buy a quid of V-Bucks. Or, 
I, ju I could just get the 20 quid and get all of them. Like, genuinely, I'm legit considering it. I don't know how long the thing's for. Like, if they're going to just get rid of the skins after the 12 hours or if they're just staying for a while. Update, check back to see what's new. Uh, currently available items may rotate or leave and new items may be added. I need to know the timing of all this. Oh, and then there's also this shit down here. Bro, we got Black Talon of all swords. But to be fair, it's a cool looking sword. So it's cool that it's in the game. Let me just... Oh, this is what they meant for thing. Oh, yeah, so these are... This, oh, this... Sh okay, shader. I was gonna be like, bro, these aren't the, like, sparrows for these. Uh, and then we have... Oh, crown splitter. Bro. Do you have to just be Zavala to use it, though? <laughs> Imagine that. <clears throat> and probably the best sword. Laminant. Look at how much cooler that looks in this, in Fortnite. Just because it's, like, always revved up and stuff. And it's smoking and shit as well. That's cool. <gasps> Bruh, you can't tell me no. 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 I've, I've actually about to low-key drop fucking 30 euro on this game, I swear. Oh, but I could just buy it for 300. I already have V-Bucks from when I saved them in the Battle Pass. I'm sorry. I had to do it. I had to do it. I had to get one. Uh, equip. Okay, what, what does it mean by equip, though? Where is it equipped? Oh, Gaming Legends series. Okay, so they're probably going to plan more stuff. Okay. And then Lambden's 800 by itself. Man, we're, we're not even like... Like, seven minutes into the stream and I've already gotten a new emote. Like, Actually, just give me a sec. I, I need to do a few things. Again, again, we'll make sure to look over everything. We'll even go onto the map as well to have a look at what it looks like in Fortnite. And then we'll go back to Destiny 2. Okay? Trust. Never mind, that's the wrong... <laughs>
fucking... Wow, I can't remember. It's been so long. But yeah, no, honestly, low-key, I might, like, just get that, just because I can. Like, I mean, what's the total? So that's 3,000... 4,200, so that's 40-odd euro just for all the Destiny stuff. <laughs> I'm sad, I know. But to be fair, I could just skimp out a bit, and I could just get, like, Elsie. Hmm, I could just get Elsie and the sword. Because I already got Investigate, I could just get that. Because I'll be real, I don't even really know if I want the Sparrows. I think I kind of would just want Lamnant and the Exo Stranger. Or, I, or, or Savala, sorry, because like he has the ghost. But then again, that's why, Joe, we're talking about this bundle, because you can get both of them in the same bundle with Ikora and stuff. Oh, uh, what was here before? Oh, it was the Dragon Ball one. Okay, we're changing. There you go. I have to. I can't get over how, like, fucking accurate the ghosts look in detail. Like, again, they just ported it straight over from, like, Destiny, I swear. Right, anyway, sorry, enough, uh, golly gallion. Gilly golly goo. Uh, we are going to go to Javelin 4. We're going to do this in a private game because honestly I've already played a uh, thing and honestly it is sweaty as hell we're just gonna have to like to take a quick look around and I think I'll play as I think it's warlock you'll see in a minute because you can choose a class but like obviously like not everything's one-to-one -one, especially because it's like a creator that made this rather than epic themselves but it's cool that Epic, like, give these, like, creators the ability to make these kind of things. To be, like, featured as a big mode as well. So, yeah, this is what I mean. So, you have all that. We have the Hunters, where you have, um, hand cannon, submachine gun, and a sticky grenade. Which I guess is meant to be, like, kind of like a trip mine, in a sense. We got, uh, that... I can't remember. Burst AR, I think it is. We got the... Well, it nearly actually looks like the... Uh, that one sniper from Destiny 1. He'll explain it in a minute. Okay, let me just choose Warlock real quick. Okay, I've already chosen thing, but as you can see, there's a shotgun thing and thing as well. I think the Titan class is the better class. And yeah, as you can see at the top uh, left as well. Your super car just charges over time. I think it also has to do something with zones as well. Maybe not. I might be chatting. So, oh yes, the hunting rifle. I don't know why Warlock's got the short end of the stick and got, like, these guns, but yeah. Because, again, I'll be honest... The, the only viable class in this is probably a uh, thing. Oh. Oh, because I'm a warlock, I can jump high. That is so cool. I love that attention to detail. But, um... Yeah, as I was saying, Titan's the best one. Because you get an AR, you get a shotgun. And so on and so forth, like. So what's this? Is this just a stink grenade? Bro, Warlock, Warlocks really did just get a stink fucking grenade, man. <laughs> That's so shit. Because I think Titans get an actual grenade. And the, obviously, the Hunters get the uh, sticky grenade as well. But yeah, they're also, they also have the uh, supers in the game as well. Well, I say supers, but... Not one for one. But look at this, though, right? How How... Like, I know these flaps are actually in the positions they're meant to be as well. That's not shoddy work. Like, that's actually that's so accurate to how it is in Destiny 2. 
And then, well, obviously there's like a few Fortnite-esque kind of items around because, you know, they are still using the Epic, um, or no, the Fortnite game itself and the creative to make all this. But just, just look at the pyramid, though. How do you recreate that? That looks so good. Like, I, I can't get over it, like, how weird it is to have this in-game. Honestly, I'm not even surprised as well if in the future... Oh, Warlocks get a grenade launcher. But, um... I won't be surprised if, like, this actually makes Epic think, Oh, people really like 5v5. Maybe we should, like, <laughs> do another collab with Destiny other games to make more 5v5 modes. Because, honestly, I think a lot of people would be up for it, honestly. Because right now it's a lot of just like battle royale, like kind of esque game modes. Damn, it's one of those. Okay, wait. What if I hold? Nah, holding does nothing. But yeah, I'm sorry. We're literally just gonna wait now until the um, thing reaches to fifty. Wait, can I go? Wait, can I go out of bounds? Nope. Ah, oh, it's just like it's just like Destiny when you think you can stand on something and it's just a invisible like death barrier. But yeah. Oh yeah. Look, bro. How how do you get this? Do you just did, did they ask Bungie for that or something like, or did they somehow recreate that in the game? Because that's really cool. Right. Anyway. Uh, oh yeah, I could just check the creative menu later. Actually, I might do that. Okay. What have we got? What is this? What was that? That's not Nova. What Warlock Super is that meant to be? It's it's purple, so I'm assuming it's void. But like, what? That was so strange. Anyway, sorry, I need to hop into creative real quick now that I think about it. Just because, like, I want to see where those things are. They're basically just showing me all the news bits I haven't seen at all. Uh. Create? Yeah, that one. I think that's how you do it. <laughs> I'm sorry, I can't get over that. That is just so cool. My, like, fucking two games I used to play so much together are just, like, finally collabing. Like, it's it's so weird. You know? Oh, but I just realized, though, if I start spending too much money in this... Ah, oh, bad. Okay, but to be fair, I'm not gonna buy the, um... I'm not gonna pre-order Lifefall until, like, maybe next year at this point. Oh, yeah, there we go. This should work. Oh my god, they fucking kept everything here? I can't believe that. That is so weird. Oh, I forgot I can even do that. Where's the phone again? How do I get to it? Recently added. Okay, but is there... Chest levels, galleries, devices. What the fuck is all this shit, man? I remember that. God, everything used to be so much simpler. Ah. Uh... Let's see, what, what have we got for weapons? Oh yeah, there's epics, or exotics. That's like, this is Fortnite's version of exotic. Um, oh, there it is, the Infinity Blade, bro. Never seen that before. That's probably the ray gun I was just using. Oh, the explosive bow's a thing now? Mythic? Why does that look like... A fucking dregs weapon. I swear that looks like a dregs weapon. It probably isn't. God, there's so much. Wait, did I say Sloan's? No, I don't think that's our Sloan. 
Bro, what's this scythe? There's so much stuff here that I'm so confused about. Okay, not that actually, I know that. Bro, is Thanos' this gauntlet anywhere? I doubt they have any of that stuff still in. Damn, the amount of weaponry in this game. Okay, if, um... Chest levels... Um, where would I even go? I just say wall, right? Oh. I, I need to hold this whilst typing. It won't let me search, though. I'm so confused. New this season. Assistant, chunkers, dusty event. <clears throat> Is that like the actual giant robot? Floating, happy, lighthouse. <laughs> lighthouse? Prison, ruined, slurp. Yeah, I don't think we're going to find it, honestly. UFO spawner? What is that? Okay, and then where's that scythe? I actually want to scythe real quick. Grapple bow? Wait, where's the things I'm looking for? That's what's in the chat. Okay, wait, how do I get the thing done? No, I can't type that. So how do I... There we go. Is there any frozen ice cream? Guzzling ice cream cone. Simple material powder. Oh, these, some of these are probably from Save the World as well. Is that? It's the rock. Alright, let's. How do I place the chest? Wait. Create chest. Anyway. I swear there was something else I got. That's so weird. So, oh wait, I have no ammo now. Cool. <laughs> customize part, bro. You can customize particles. Sheesh. Oh, that is so cool. Wait, when is it ready? There's just something about this fucking gameplay that is so cool. Let me do one more charge. I want to see if I could just charge straight for the cube. Just, just con. Wait, is it not going to do a thing? Oh, shit. Oh, there I go. Maybe if I use this, I might be able to save myself. Oh, okay, so there's only so much. That is so cool. Anyway, sorry. I got a bit distracted there with Fortnite. Let's uh, leave the game, close it out. And then we'll actually play Destiny 2. Again, just for anybody watching the stream, uh, just let you know. Because I'm the harbinger of Destiny stuff. Actually, I need to look at this emote one more time. Uh, they are doing a thing now where you can get the 30th anniversary pack for free on the Epic Game Store. And everywhere they have all the expansions free as of right now. So if you wanted to play Destiny, this is your chance between 24th and 29th. Bungie, please give me my sponsorship money. I'm joking, I'm joking, I'm joking. Maybe I should have closed that first. Actually, wait. Let me uh, swap this over to this screen. 
Um, oh, yeah, another thing I was going to say here, because um, I was saying ages ago that there's like this secret thing that I can't talk about right now. I can talk about it because it's not going to happen. Uh, uh, we were in the plans to move house, but let's just say that plan has fallen through. So, yeah, I am still going to be living here for a while. There's going to be no worry about the streams just on the ending. So, yeah, that's that, that's really it. it. It is how it is. It's, it's kind of shitty, and I kind of read their message as fucking hostile is all I can say, but... Yeah. But it is... It's just hypocritical, like... With the shit they're saying in it, they're telling us to do. But if we did that initially before we, like, wanted to move house, they would have just fucking ignored us anyway. Like, I have to say this. They're just pricks. They just are. Like, if they're, like, bleeding... If, if they... If, if the way I picked up that message was the way I was meant to which I highly doubt they were really being that hostile, but they could have been. Uh, yeah, they're dickheads. That's all i got to say. But that's where you guys come in. If you guys donate to the stream, I can move house and actually pay for a house for my parents. You know, I actually was low-key just thinking of there, actually. I should probably get the Patreon started back up and decide what the hell I'm going to do with that. But then again, I think, like, the problem is, though, if I do that... What thing can I really do on the Patreon that would encourage people to want to, like, sub to it, you know? Because, like, I'm already giving out all the Sherry Aubrey's info for free, and, like, if I had to silence myself during streams, if I if I ever mentioned thing, then I don't want to do that. Gee, 100... What the... F Bro, I just realized... 104 days, that's so long. But then again, Joe, 104 plus, plus, and plus, you know? Oh, they actually have this here. Pre-order now, life fall, prevent the apocalypse, and then we have season of the plunder. Oh, they're, they're using the same fucking image for spiders during um, season of the hunt. Were they meant to? Because these two have different images. Look at that. Red war, curse, war mind, forsaken, shadow keep, the traveler's back, beyond light. Then we have 30th Anniversary, The Witch Queen, Lightfall. I wonder if they're going to push like those two back to here once it comes around, or if they're just going to keep it the way it is. Because honestly, it's cleaner probably this way. Just that, like having this on this screen. Because then after this, like assuming there's not going to be much... Oh, wow, they even gave it a special effect as well to encourage people to click on it more. But um, what was I going to say? Yeah, so like in the future, like, you know, once this part ends... Like, at least it'll be here, you know? And this is where we currently are. We haven't reached this point yet. Again, I'm I'm thinking about it, but I think I'll just wait until, like, um, like next year to pre-order it. Because, like, it's coming out in February, you know? Like, I don't really want to buy it now. Well, I say it's coming out in February, but watch it be pushed to something like June or something like that. <laughs> how much how gas that would be, though? Um, okay. What have we got here? The weapon still? Okay. Now, let's try the quest again, and let's see if it actually works this time. Wait, can I... No, it's not there. Catch crash. I already purchased that. I already got things out of that. Right, okay. Because actually, yeah, now that I think about it, yeah, it's not even counting for completions. Maybe I just missed something the last time, honestly. I won't be surprised, though, because, like, I'm a dumbass, like. Oh, yeah, I want to do this. Oh. Oh, that's... Oh, that's the Trials one. Oh, they actually allow you to look at the fucking mementos? That's so cool. Where's the other ones? Why is it just the Trials one? Why can't I view the other ones? I guess we won't be able to see them. That looks kind of cool. Just like, you know, just default kind of shaders, but like, still kind of works out. Oh my god, <laughs> I got chocolate vibes off that one. 
It's always mandatory. Every time I have a crafted weapon, I have to at least give it like a shader. That kind of looks cool. The only thing I don't like is this up here, but I guess you can't really change that. Oh, it looks really cool. It looks really cool. There's something about red that just can't be beat. And plus, I am a hunter, so I always gravitate to black and red. That just makes it more shiny. Do I want it more shiny? Nah. Oh, but you gotta try this. Crimson Day. Never mind. It doesn't even give it a tiny bit of red. Ah, I wanted to see what the thing was. Not that one. Not that one. I, I don't even know which one it was anymore. That's actually kind of cool. Pink? Pink! Aw, uh, well, it is pink, but meh. I don't know. Oh my god, I'm an idiot. I apologize. <laughs> I was doing all that and I didn't even realize that I didn't have thing. Dun 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 Don't let this Rambo destroy my pet. It's not your ship anymore, boss. I already put my scent all over it. Never mind. Keep it guardian. Ugh. That was a T posing one. I'm just too lazy to use the other gun, so I'm just going to use this. I think the, like, arc, um, like, stuff is actually, like, dropping my frames. Oh my god. Now nah, this guy will die. He'll definitely die before we go on the thing. There you go. You best believe it. Always gotta check. One day the mic will change again without me knowing, and it'll be hell. I guess we will wait for that one guy. Information from the servitors. The skiff blades prove their bravery once again. Okay. 
Okay, where are the yokes, though? Oh, capture coins. There you go. Come on, there we go. Gotta DPS the shit out of him most we can. Oh my god, the amount of them around me. Ugh, ugh. Oof. How salvation. They seek, yes. Yeah, actually, no. Oh, yeah, Varix is still back on Europa. Well, he is here. No. Yeah, yeah, Joe, we're in deep space. We're not on Europa right now. Oh, God. There we go. I need it. But I basically was like, you know what? I might as well just keep shooting at this point, like. Yeah, to be fair, we're going to be going like on multiple different ships over time before we find out there. Come on. Run! There you go. I don't even know if that damage will transfer, but it, it is how it is. Oh, return. We're going home. Take out those ether tanks, hero. They'll feel that for sure. Eh. Keep punching, Joe. Don't give up. Don't give up in your dream to beat one of these guys to death with just your fists. Ah, uh, the fucking... Bro, why? I was doing so good and you had to kill him. Okay, where... Where's the best place to throw this? Nowhere right now. Why are they so tough? That's better. That's it. That's what we're looking for. Okay, where? There it is. Thank you. Right, oh shit. I actually forgot I had that, I'm not gonna lie. Uh, okay, there's nothing. Oh, there's one up here. No, he's got that. Uh, okay, there's one right here. And that shank even got caught in it, so, you know, it's a big advantage for us. I think there's, like, one more. I wonder if he sees it. There you go. You're almost home free, hero. Oh Just shit, I didn't mean to do that. Matter of a large army on deck. This crew is caught between your light and Erebus's wrath. They will not relent. Imagine how weird if it was if they actually made Mithrax one of the, uh, oh. Made Mithrax one of the thing. Oh, okay.
Like Mithrax one of the Fortnite skins. I love the way the only way we can be our technical guardian selves is in fall, guys. But that's not until like next month. Sorry, excuse me, pardon me, come through. I'm coming in here to fucking skewer you. And then you go do your thing. I'm so bad at sniping. <laughs> Damn, the speed at which we're melting. Maybe that's why. Maybe it's because like we're melting him too fast. That's why we didn't get the thing the last day. I need to clear the field a bit. I'm, I'm literally shooting at a guy. I thought I was shooting at a thing. Damn, that's B booster. Okay, now when we open this. Spider, do you have any hatchlings yourself? <laughs> Mission complete. Oh my god, and the thing's done as well. I, ah, I love the way he didn't even have to answer the question. He just laughed at her and then just like, I see. Oh, thank the Lord, man. If if that wouldn't work there, I actually would just... I, I don't know what I'd do, honestly. At that point, we might as well just grind for level if it didn't work, like. But yeah, like, all, the, all that talk, though, about us losing the last city and stuff doesn't seem to be happening next expansion, if you've already seen the... Lifefall DLC um, teaser. Well, not really teaser, an actual trailer. It's just like I don't know. I'm, I'm because like right now they're like if they're all on Neptune. Like, is it a case then that maybe this next seasonal story is us being pushed back slowly, like one place at a time with the Cloud Strikers? Because I assume that's the only other thing that could happen, right? A reward awaits you beside the star chair. It rests on a scrap of paper covered in surprisingly delicate handwriting. I knew you had it in, had the steel for it, the note reads. Now gather your crew and begin your journey. I've met a few pirate captains in my time, and you can't be any worse than them. Good luck. The note bears spider's insignia. So, visit the star chair in the helm. Oh, I, mean, I meant to read what else that said. Oof. I thought the elixir had moved on from such senseless brutality. It seems I was mistaken. Aramis has awoken and has summoned the old crews to aid her. Regrettably, it falls on you to stop them. For that, you will require a star chart and a captain's atlas. Spider had these antiques in his collection. Use them if you must, but remember that you are a guardian chosen by the light. These pirates, brutal remnants of our past, are not. Aramis chose to ally with them for a reason. They know the stars in a way even how salvation does not. Oh, so they're in their faction. That Erebus may seek. Maybe no mind. Raise arms against these pirates and discover the truth. Watch Mithrax and Aramis be like parents of Ido or some shit. Or like Aramis be like Ido's mother or some shit. <laughs> it's just like, that'd be so fucking weird. 
Because, like, there's a thing going on between him and Aramis, and that's what I get. That's the weirdest thing that came to my mind first. Methrax Kell of House Light seems shaken by the violent uh, violence employed by Aramis and the pirate crews at her command. Explains the heavy book Star Trek. Captain Zazu was she enabled to command your ship and crew. He asked that you discover Aramis uh, using these old crews. They know, but does not know. Searching for finding answers. Examine the detail of Captain Atlas in your quest. Restore treasure map in Captain's Atlas using thing and treasure corn is provided. So, defeat combatants with solar, sidearm, and those are random. I don't think I'll bother because they just give XP right now. What's this? Oh yeah, this is our thing for now, so that's what repute is for. Then we got these options for weaponry. Okay, 67, 70. Obviously, I'm gonna put that on first because that's the thing. Okay, wait, what do you want, skeleton key? There you go, have fun with that. 68, 70. God, a lot of this, I, like, all, a lot of the stuff on this character is all just crafted, I just realised. That's a good thing, though, in a sense, I guess. I'm gonna do this now, but watch me replace the helmet, like, two seconds later, like. Okay. Just checking that this won't change, will it? This will probably just stay at 70. Yeah. But to be fair, I haven't leveled up above 70 yet, so... I'd have to come back later just to double-check that. Oh, now I can get my energy. Thank you. Uh, from Bonus Buried Treasure. Oh, there's a lot of things confusing me. Okay. Bro, there's so much. Again, Bungie, why so many currencies, bro? My little brain can't handle all of it. Okay, um... Quests. So that's this joke, I'm assuming? Captain's Atlas. Elixir Pirate Lord item. A battered atlas used to log the locations of hidden riches and planned voyages with a crew. So we got this, and we can put this stuff in. So you need plundered umbral energy... Oh, so that's what you get, sorry. And then Expedition Gear. And you have five map fragments and treasure coordinates to do it. Loot buried treasure at the end of an expedition activity. So I want, uh, that's probably the uh, weekly quest now, isn't it? Assume. Yep. Expedition player. Bra Damn, I'm already savvy fucking rank three. Sheesh. Avoid and stasis singe, but you know what? I don't care. I'm leaving Archon. I know there's a shader that messes with thing. I mean, that actually did a great job. Oh my god, that... Bro. Okay, yeah, that's the only one, I think. That one shader I was just looking at is the one that, like, has a big impact on the skull itself. But that kind of looks cool as well. If the purple jaw wasn't there. But yeah, this one. Makes it all look fractaline. Oh, and it stops its... Well, unless that's some loading, but it looks like it stops it fl its flames. Never mind, it doesn't, yeah. It was just a loading that did that. Quick little idol. Must run in the 
Oh yeah, and we have thing there. Oh, this is a shotgun. <laughs> I didn't even realize that. I should probably swap off thing. Um, for now, we'll swap back, but then I need to swap back to thing. Right, what do I need to do? Oh my god, my fucking nose, man. It's so annoying. A jammer has stopped the drill. My splicer got the tongues. Something interferes with the drill. Seek it out. I wonder if that's just in the skybox now, like when you go to Europa, or if it's just for this activity. Either way, it's cool. Oh. Oh, so you just shoot it. Oh, there they are. I was like, wait, where'd they spawn? Like, This fellow doesn't even know which way he's going. Poor guy. I'm gonna have to put you on, I guess. Ugh. Oh, wait, I can't do that right now. Yes, Joe, shoot the guys that are the farthest away first, and then shoot the others that were actually shooting you. Oh, it's a good ball. And he got decimated. Poor guy. <laughs> I thought th I thought he said Sabathun. I'm like, wait, what? Wait, where's Sabathun come in this story? Oh, overload? Bro, that is so handy. Legitimately, that is the handiest thing that's ever happened so far with Thunderlord. It's just having that automatic, just like, thing, man. Eh, they'll come to us. Bro, why am I so bad at shooting? Oh. Hand grab in my face. I get the farthest one out. Oh, <laughs> oh, the thing just goes. It doesn't know what to track to anymore since it doesn't need to track to it. Oh, yup. 
Season rank up three. Yeah, I heard as well right now in the game, uh, grenade launchers are meant to be doing like a ridiculous amount of damage to what they're meant to be doing. So if you have like anarchy or even a legend good like legendary grenade launcher, you should probably like put that on. I'm just using Thunderlord just because I can. I love how it's still playing the Beyond Light sound. But to be fair, we are on Europa, so I should. Right, what's happening? Oh, that's it. I feel like I get another one in the future. Hey, I'm still holding on to that <laughs> from ages ago. Right, hopefully that actually counted because I did. I wasn't even looking if that did. Nope, loot buried treasure at the end of the thing. I did. It literally did it, and it didn't count. And now I can't go back in. Because I've already used the bits needed to go in. Because as far as... I, I need to do something with the book, don't I? Heard by completing other activities, but what do I... It's funny how... Oh yeah, there we go. Never mind. Oh man! I did. I, I I I I I I opened it. I opened the thing. Am I just stupid? I think I'm stupid. Wait, did that? Yeah, it counted as well. Treasure acquired. Oh, that's so annoying, man. I don't want to have. Okay, this is the last time I'm doing this all over again, and then we're just going to look at doing some other things in the game, because I can't be arsed with the quest line if it's still broken, like. Well, sorry, broken in many aspects, not still broken, there's a big difference. <sighs> I'm just so done right now. Yeah, I have curiosity. What is the dungeon this week? It's not there. Oh, is it the Dreamy City? Oh, what is it? The Shattered Throne? Again, I swear last week it was already Shattered Throne, man. Grasp, obviously, nah. Oh, that's a, uh, that's thing. That's um saying. I don't know why it took me forever to say his name.
far. I wanted to see if I could dupe it somehow. There goes my sparrow. Man, that this gun's putting me to sleep, I'm not gonna lie. But I must level up gun. Most level crafted weapon. No, I want to slide. There we go. Jesus. Took me a while. Oh, sorry, I'm kind of falling asleep here, not gonna lie. I've just been out of it, honestly. Oh, my fucking nose, I hate it. I think it's like nose hairs just tickling my like nostrils for no reason. Like, I didn't want to hear what you, I didn't hear what you said, Saint. But thank you. Oh, this has headshot in it. That is so weird for a shotgun to like have. Um, no, uh, it's not headshot. What's it called? I can see now. Whilst I'm dead, I guess. Uh, headstone. That's it. Sooner I throw the treasure, the better. I like the way these engrams have just been like repurposed. They're not even fake anymore. They actually are loot now. Just not our loot. Well, technically our loot, but like we won't be able to access it in game. When you think about it, the wealthiest motherfucker in the entire game must be your own guardian, right? Like the amount of shit your guardian just collects over time. Aww. 
Do I have to finish the progress on this? Fine, I guess I'll change. Ah. Oh shit, I didn't mean to do that. Oh, oh, it's just stuck there. I thought it actually attached to the payload, man. That would be so funny. Is the big guy in yet? I'm assuming by those sounds he is. Or at least he's approaching. Sorry, can I just do that real quick? Thank you. Oh, f why did I not see? I looked at it, I was like, yeah, no, I'll be grand. It's like, no, it fucking lands right on me, I'm an idiot. Oh yeah, I auto reload because I slid on that. Maybe kill the big guy first, Jim. There we go. Well, I say there we go, but we haven't even finished it. Still got a few scallywags left over. As they might be inclined to say this season. Oh, they deserve each other. Maybe they aren't together then. Right, what have we got? We got uh, claim the successful X2 weekly challenge in the seasonal plunder sections of your quest. Oh, so it literally is just go to the quest and do this. Imagine if it bugged out there, man. Upgrade the star chart and the helm. So we'll go to Helm. There it is. Matt, the amount of icons here, man. They could have at least put them like one on top of the other instead, right? Because even look at the Psyops, they're like tiny icons now. Oh, excuse me. Dun, 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 dun. 
Glimmer treasure map. I mapped out pointing the location of hidden treasures at the end of an expedition mission. Cool. Oh, I'm already brave rank 5. Jeez. Where have we got? We got summoned to serve the crewmate from their pirate banner during catch crash and expedition missions. Skur V grants you slightly increased reload speed while they're in combat. Skur V also unlocks armor focusing, allowing umbral engrams to be decrypted into season of plunder armor once it has been added to your collection. Also unlocks the ability to occasionally find treasure corners and defeat combatants. Summon Hel Helxis, the sniper crewmate from his pirate banner during thing. Grants you slightly increased precision damage whilst he's in combat. And it also unlocks random bonus reward when you emo with your crew at the end of a successful thing. Summon the skiff blades crewmate from their pirate banner during thing. I think it's between... So wait, so armor focusing and thing. I think this one then. Yeah, we'll go with this one. I'll regret it later, but yeah. Purchase all upgrades from Star Chart in the Helm. I didn't. Oh, this is part one, that's why. Complete pirate hideout, Vlog the Brutes. Okay. There's so much for my little brain to try and catch up with. Um. Got this, this, and this. Got potentially stuff in here. Seventy, Right, that should be grand. Oh, my hair dropped there for a minute. Sorry. Anyway, um, what should I call it? Oh, this is, bro. Come on, the fucking organization of these icons. But then again, I guess it makes sense because like this part is like. The uh, Crown of Sorrow part, so. Whew. Right. Yeah, you know, actually, before. Just, 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 just go, Jeff. Just, just, just do it. No delay. Just go. We unlock the next path, anyway. Uh, yeah. Oh, I keep. I need to put away those weapons before they take up too much space. 67 Whoa, okay Bro, this is so cool. Oh my god. Look at all that shit all the green stars Look at that name as well. He's a cabal defector. But for which side, I couldn't tell you. Red Legion. I, I let you see your thing just say. Okay, spider. So wait, there's just 
I love the way there's just casually fallen and like Cabal just working together down here. I guess that's what this has turned into right now. Damn, thank god you didn't blast me away like this guy might. Let me guess, throw it at the door. Yup. You know, honestly, some of this stuff is actually kind of bringing back Forsaken vibes. When you think about it. Because some of the mechanics are kind of Forsaken-esque, you know? You know what? Fuck it, actually. Put this back on. How much damage does this do to you? 21,000. Okay, that's quite a bit, I think. Maybe. Oh, wait, I could die from this. Hold on. I think I hit them. Wow, I, I hit them so good that they had to go into shield. Maybe I need to slow down a bit and actually take some of the enemies out. Or even get some of this ammo. Some of this ammo looks nice. Look at the amount I'm getting here. But that'll be next week in Dragon Ball Z. Oh yeah, I need to actually go here. Bro, it's like, okay, we have the tower, and then we have to go to Helm, and then we have to go to the Elixir Quarter, and then there's also the lighthouse you can go to for trials, and there's also Zer's Treasure Hoard. Like, again, remember what they said? They were just like, nah, we don't think we need much social spaces, and they have, like, Literally five in the game right now. 
At least three are permanent anyway. But yeah, honestly, if they're gonna sunset anything, can they sunset like Nessus and the EDZ or something? That would make a huge amount of sense, honestly. Oh, but maybe not the EDZ now that I think about it. Or, but then again, Nessus has some for a thing. I, I don't know, it depends. Hello, I don't. My father and I are already studying the relic you reclaimed from the pirates. I am eager to learn the nature of the strange energies that seep from within. I was thrilled to aid in your engagement with Aramis's fleet. I hope my support was beneficial. Although I admit I am unused to the rigors of combat. While I did study with the Awoken Techians, gunplay was never a part of the syllabus. I am proud of the progress we made together. Thank you for including me as part of your crew. I must continue my studies. May the light provide. Despite the casual atmosphere in the youth tank, you receive a Vanguard secured uh, commu communication from Ido to your case subscribe. It's already busy. She thanks you for uh, booting prior crew. Excuse her uh, for her study. Cool. And then it's going to be like, wait and see what they do. Oh, no, visit Spider. I love how like he just has a sign out for himself now. No hiding this time. That's a brig, isn't it? No, it's a little mini spider tank. Oh, that's so cute. Bro. Oh, yeah, and this is the bar where we all drank as well. That's mad. I think you'll find our friendship agreeable. Oh, they brought all his lines back as well. I remember that one. That's why I was, like, sinking it. A gentle spider gestures uh, grandly to a set of engrams he has laid out before him. Just a guardian I wanted to see. Mm. Just a guardian I wanted to see, he says with a grin. I told the vanguard I had a plan to help arm the guardians against Aramis's forces. They funded me with some glimmer, and I traded it in for some incredible gear. But just handing out weapons, he trails off, shaking his head. Where's the fun in that? I thought I'd make it a little more interesting. He purrs, rubbing his hands together excitedly. So pick an engram, any engram, and reveal your prize. Oh, cool. I actually got a deep sight weapon from that. Check in with Spider in the ether tank. I just did, though. <laughs> Wait, what? Spider looks at your reward, clearly impressed. Jackpot! Your one savvy customer, Guardian. He shakes his head and chuckles. Take it easy on me, please, he laughs. I'll let you know when I have more engrams for you. But if you're that lucky every time, I'll lose money on this little act of benevolence. So I could have got something shit. That's probably why, like, he's telling me this now. So if I got something shit, it probably would have been something different. Ido's voice crackles over your radio. I noticed you were taking in the sights in the Elixney Quarter, she says brightly. I actually was as well, yesterday. That might explain the strange energy readings I just picked up from the ether tank. Please carry on, Ido says. Don't let me interrupt your re uh, recreation. Or recreation. Mythrax and Ido are studying what you recover, Pilot. They will contact you as soon as they have more information. So basically that means, like, yes, this is the end of the story this week. Wait, so Spider doesn't do anything else. Right, just making sure. Yeah. Agreeable. Oh, we actually get to listen to the message this week as well.
Uh, sorry. Damn. <laughs> you know, honestly, Eris isn't even make that bad of a point. It's just like she's just found better power and like, well, so more powerful. And like, you know, at this point, if she were to defect, that would not go well. And plus, I believe the Dark Future lore book, like in the alternative timelines, that like um, Aramis was like one that stood with the witness as everything collapsed or something. So, yeah. I don't think she's going to turn sides, unless it does change. But she could. You never know. Maybe at the end, like, that's what happens. She actually is like, you know what? Fine, we'll, we'll join you guys. Why not? But I wonder why freeze her for all that time instead of having her do shit? It's a very curious question of you, Joel. I guess now we just gotta look into the, um, I guess the, just, quests, I guess? Because what else can I do? So, uh, return the first relic to the helm. Also defeat combatants on Europa, defeat combatants, oh wait, oh, relic placed. How do I do that? Shape three unique seasonal weapons. That's good, definitely going to be over time. Uh, find complete catch ca catch crash activities and activate cannons aboard deck on your catch. You know they should have made the grasp of Avri Avarice the one that was like um, dropping pinnacle right now, because it's such a shame that it's not like on your upper earn progress by thing. Uh, complete weekly challenges. Uh, some of those actually might be near. <laughs> complete gambit matches. Nah. Uh, long range pulse bow trace on Europa. And I nearly got that done anyway. And then combat fallen combatants in Vanguard playlists. Okay, so... Hold on, let me go to the helm and see if I can place the thing. Where would I even place it, though? Wait, no, yeah, it said the helm, Joe. I'm 100% sure on that. So... Ah, that's that's confusing me. I need to put these weapons away as well when I remember. Oh, maybe not Beloved, actually. Isn't Beloved... Yeah, it's one off. Okay, yeah, Joe, ju just do it now. Trust. Right, now I need to go... To... Uh, I need. Can I mark the Enclave before we do that? Quick. No, I can't. Okay, I need to go, like, shape the weapon. So, how do I place this, Joe? Oh, there we go. Guardian, the artifact you recovered from the Pirate Lord's hideout has incredible research potential. I'll leave records of my findings here. Come by after you recover a new reliquary to learn what I've discovered. Spectral analysis indicates trace amounts of darkness energies radiating from within the vessel. However, the reliquary is made of a super dense substance, like a lead barrier around uranium. This leads me to deduce that the relic itself is likely quite powerful, and potentially harmful if handled directly. Cool, good to know I dragged that thing all around without worry. Oh yeah, and I can get more repute from that as well. So, weekly challenges and mayhem. Maybe I should at least do mayhem before I leave it too much. 
Because, like, last time we left it way too late. Let's see, what have we got? Earn bonus glimmer at the end of an expedition. Unlocks the plunder armor focus map in the Atlas Captain thing. Increase the chance to earn season of the plunder gear by completing uh, ke catch crash missions. Hmm. And then this one lets you hire, like, thing. I think maybe it'd be cooler to hire extra peeps, but... I mean, to be fair, though, the Guardians are quite enough to fucking fight off, like, the forces, so... Yeah, I'd rather the extra chance of the seasonal stuff. Right. We'll go to the Enclave, and I'll think about going into Mayhem as well. It's time to craft Beloved. That lore book looks like it had something to do with Aramis anyway. Right. Uh, more swords. Cause thing. Reduced impact, yeah. I think I'd rather that for now. Just double checking. Yeah, it's just that. Uh, oh yeah, and I need to put away a weapon. There you go. Wait, actually, is the shotgun pattern the lot? Yeah, it's five. You know, now that I think about it, there are a lot of patterns I'm probably not even going to get done just because I'm not arsed to go through the motion to get them, like. Ascenta Dalai Requisition. The shadow of power manifests in your thoughts. An intense wave of... I wrote to obtain one. Oh, yeah, so that's just... Oh, it's giving me an extra quest just so I could do thing. Could weekly campaign mission to receive Ascendant Alloy. Uh, a clawing at the back of your mind. Your deep side stirs. The memory of a weapon appears before you. Take it and unlock its full potential. Deep side of a weapon and use it across thing. Okay, just keep giving me things. Uh, the vision of the foundry weapon dances across your mind. It's shape half remembered. It will take effort to fully understand it. Cool. Thanks for the free deep sight weapon. Okay, so increase accuracy, stability, and handling when fire while crouch. Grants increase reload speed when close to a full magazine. Kills with weapon uh, increased damage. Uh, using this weapon to break a shield, combatant or guardian, their super will grant you an overshield. Um, yeah. Then you can have the choice of the memento. Oh, but yeah, I can take th I just realized that now. Because I did that. I can now go back into my vault, do thing, and then maybe we'll do like three matches of mayhem, see how things are right now in Crucible. Or at least a match. But honestly, I'm not going to lie, I'm not in the mood really to play more Destiny. I think I've tuckered myself out completely for it now. Okay, that's it. That's my only options. Just secondary weapons. Oh, actually. Nah, Joe. Just, just do what you have. Subsistence? Wait. Do I have another SMG? I don't. I haven't used a fusion in a while, so... I'm going to hold on to that one. And uh, da, 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 da. so many secondary weapons, man. Okay, uh, I don't know what to put away though. 
Ah, whatever. Let's see, is there any seasonal weapons that I'm holding? Yep. And we'll just get this one, I guess. Might as well get the frames done. Oh, we're at exactly 10,000. Never mind, we won't. That's the first time I think I've ever hit exactly 10,000, like. Damn, the amount of quests now. So, complete activity in Vanguard Players Crucible Gambit while defeating combatants with a deep sight resident weapon equipped. So, basically, don't complete it until you've done that quest. God, man, okay. Um. Nah, I'll leave it there. I'm sorry, I'm not really in the mood to, like, play more. I just want to go off for now, and then I'll think about what I'm going to do with myself. So, yeah. Thank you so much for watching the stream. Uh, hopefully, I'll see you later today or tomorrow. So, goodbye.